Last to sink gets ten thousand dollars. You're such a troll right now. You don't think I'm gonna take this challenge? All right. I'm coming for that ten grand. <gasps> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Ah! Ah! Goodbye. Ah! 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 Ginger, I'm the one that won the last family challenge against you on the giant board game in real life. And so I'm the game master and I came up with today's challenge. We're gonna do that last to sink for $10,000. Oh yeah. So we have to go to the store and only using oh mega gosh. Lego blocks and $20 for what we can fit in our shopping $20, cart. $20, Carl? We have to make a raft to see who can win $10,000 last to sink. And here's the catch. I what? think I made a big mistake. Oh no. Feel the water, feel the no. water. Carl. <laughs> I left the heater off. Carl! It's freezing cold! It's freezing cold! What do you think, puppy dog? Is the swimming pool too cold? <laughs> You're so cute, Leela. What in the world are you doing? Oh, Ginger's got the giant mega Lego blocks. So should we just say each of us gets one box and that's all you get? There you go. You are making this difficult, Carl. Oh yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. Challenge accepted. You'll be going to take this challenge. Yeah, right. All I'm right. coming for that 10 grand. Beep, beep. Look beep. out, Leela. You want to ride the Legos? You want to ride the giant Legos? No. Here we go. Beep, beep. <laughs> You're like a queen. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> She's like, get me off of here. <laughs> Yay. Someone got that zoomie. The big rule is, is that we only get one box of giant mega Legos and we only get $20 at the store and it has to fit in the shopping cart. So I think the next step is we have to go to the store and spend our $20 All on right, our raft supplies. Let's go. Let's do it. Come on, Leela, let's go to the store. Let's go. If Leela was included in this challenge, she would totally win because she's so tiny. You I could, know, she could float on three plastic bricks. I know, you could just put like a couple of Legos duct taped together and put her on there and she'd just float away, huh? Ginger recently subjected me to a surprise lie detector test. <laughs> it was really crazy. She was trying to get out of me uh, a big secret that I've been holding on to. If you haven't watched that video yet, you gotta click the i card and go check that out. But she still has yet to figure out what we're doing for her birthday. I already told Leela what we're doing. She's the best Just secret keeper. She keeps all my She's secrets. She's like a vault. Come on, Leela. Spill the beans. She doesn't tell anybody. <laughs> we made it to the hardware store and now we have the challenge of $20 a piece. This one's mine. That one's yours. We have $20 to spend. Are you guys ready? I'm ready. All right, let's see what we Lila's come up ready. with. Leela's ready. Lila's let's go. Leela's giving me all the good luck right now. <laughs> all right, let's do it. Ginger, you really think that the puppy's giving you good luck? Oh yeah, well, totally. Well, good luck fitting all your supplies in that cart with a puppy in there. That's true. See ya. <laughs> she can't see me, guys. I think I lost her. Coming up with an idea of how I can float on the pool is actually harder than I thought. Like, I was hoping that in the pool area here I could find like just a cool floaty and just totally hack my way through this challenge, but I haven't found anything. So I found myself at the Tupperwares. What about something like this? Because I could buy this for $15 and then I could use some pool floaties, I think, to make it float. I totally fit in this thing. I think this works. And my partner in crime over here is zero help. Starting to get some really good ideas. I'm seeing all this patio furniture and these chairs and I'm like, instead of trying to like make some kind of a crazy chair to sit in or flotation device, why don't I just use one that's already made? You guys, I'm getting really nervous because I feel like Carl has a really good direction. He just seems like he knows what he's doing. You know what, I'm gonna go with it. I think this shallow one, I know that doesn't seem like it makes sense, my strategy is that if it's shallow, it's not gonna tip over as easy. I'm kind of going for a shallow and wide approach. Bingo, pool noodles are $2. So we have 14, 16, 18, 20. Well, basically my entire budget is completely blown now with the pool noodles and the Tupperware. So me and Leela are just chilling here until dad's done, right? Mm, I'm getting all kinds of really good ideas. So I want something like this, only it's gonna float better. Okay. I think I'm onto something. You guys, the shallow Tupperware, I just don't think is gonna work. I'm actually gonna put that one back. I found another one that's deeper and it's actually a few dollars less so I can get another pool noodle. So I'm gonna put this back. Hey, what are you doing? No, she's my good luck charm. She's the one that told me to put the Tupperware back. What are you doing? I'm getting Carl, 
<laughs> That's fine. That's fine. I'm just gonna win this challenge. That's fine. You can't stop me. So this is the one I had, and this is the one I want to get. This one right here. Oh yeah. This is a better fit than the shallow one. I feel like. Good luck, Carl. What are you? You're such a troll right now. Carl is totally trolling me on this challenge. Okay, I have a better Tupperware and I have a few more bucks, so I'm gonna go load up on pool noodles. By putting that Tupperware back, I now am only at $16, so I can get two more pool noodles. Okay, I think I'm gonna get a big green one. I'll throw in a blue one just for accents because I have so much money left over now that why not, you know? I'm back home in the garage and we're all set. We've got everything here, check this out. I've got two big rolls of bubble wrap and one lounge chair. We're gonna allow ourselves to use duct tape for free, that's okay. But this is what I have to use to try and make my floating device. Last to sink gets $10,000. Oh yeah, let's not forget, I can also use a bunch of giant Lego mega blocks. <laughs> this will help. I think I've done it. I've made my entire floating device. <laughs> Hopefully I'm gonna be the last to sink, but it's gonna be awesome, you guys. I decided not to go with any giant Legos or Mega Blocks at all, because I think what I got is going to work. I've got just enough bubble wrap, and I've got it on this lounge chair. I think this is totally gonna work. It's gonna have a ton of buoyancy underneath. There's only one way to find out, and that's to go outside and to get it in the water. What's up, guys? We got back from the hardware store, and we have my supplies all laid out here, and the plastic bricks. I am so excited to get this all put together. We decided we could use the tape here at home, so I'm gonna go grab that, and let's get building. So I've got the basic frame done with the giant Legos and the Tupperware. Now it's time just to add the floaties. I'm feeling really good about this. I feel like it's nice and wide. And once I get in there, it's just gonna be super stable. Let's just cross our fingers. <laughs> This right here is the front, and we have um, Lego bricks supporting the floats. And then in the back, I added two extra floats here. I cut the blue one in half, just for a little extra weight, which will be in the back, which is where I'll be sitting. So I think that will help a lot. You guys, I'm ready to go. I'm gonna get my swimming suit on. I'm ready to win this challenge. I'm just carrying my uh, floating device and my super awesome lounge chair back to the swimming pool. I was thinking, I don't think I'm not only gonna win this contest, I may have just like invented a new thing, a new way to recreate. Oh, wait a second, here he is, Carl! <laughs> I can oh, see your my word. device. Well, what is that? Well, I can tell that you were able to use the giant Legos and I decided that uh, I was gonna go without those. I don't think I need them. What this is, is a super <laughs> duper awesome floating device lounge chair. Look at this. What? I'm just gonna be able to sit in here like this and float all day in the pool. Carl, I feel like that's gonna tip over. You do? I do. I think it's just gonna float awesome. Look at all this. Let's I mean, there is a ton of bubble wrap. I definitely think it can hold you up. Are you kidding? Look at that. I don't it know. Looks it, it looks awesome. I I'm just I've saying, you know new. what? Maybe that's like the new pool float. I know, if I saw that in the store, I'd be like, hmm, maybe. Yeah. Maybe. Well, tell me what you think of this contraption. Uh, I'm a little concerned about your duct tape. I don't know. Well, you I have... like that you have a see-through bottom though. That would be really interesting. Do you pay extra for that in real life? That's right, when you're on vacation, <laughs> it's like for the see-through. Exactly, right? it's very luxury over here in gingerific land. You yeah. see our backrest? I see that. I don't know, there's only one way to find that's out. That's exactly you know right. You guys need to vote up in the poll up above right now. Whose flotation device do you think is gonna work? Who's gonna be last to leave, last to sink in the pool? Is it gonna be me or is it gonna be Ginger? Come on, you guys! Leela, do you wanna come and see our boats? Let's go! Watch how Leela just chases me around the yard. Look. Let's go. You get the zoomies? And there she goes. 
Urch! And when I stop, she runs right up to my feet. Ready? Here we go. She's so fast. There she goes. Urch! Right there. Isn't that awesome? Let's see if she fits in your boat, Ginger. Come here, Leela. Pew! Okay, Leela's going for a ride. I bet if that was her boat, she would totally win, right? She wouldn't sink at all. She could float forever. She's like, this looks fun, guys, but no thanks. I know. <laughs> it's time. The moment of truth. <laughs> I don't know, guys. You think it's going to sink or is it going to float? We're going to find out in just a minute. I feel like the Legos are going to help me. I know that when we have done underwater, underwater like scuba diving and snuba stuff, yeah. that it has totally floated before. But whoa, it looks completely buoyant. It feels pretty steady too. The question is, can you even get inside the boat? <laughs> That's the real I have a strategy for that too. Okay. What's that? I'm using the step of the pool to balance myself. You see, I'm inside now. Oh yeah, because you've got a, like a glass bottom boat, so you can totally see everything going on, right? Yeah, but the trick is getting off the step. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Okay, wait, wait, wait. Here okay, I'm gonna start a new clip. The time starts now. And here we go! There you go. All right. You're already a good five seconds in, Ginger, and so far so good. Okay. Looks like you're floating around. Okay. Okay. Do you feel like it's uh, floating or sinking? Yeah, totally. No, I just kind of have to balance so I don't take on any water. Right. So I think this is working out way better than I expected, okay? I'm balanced. I feel like my weight is <laughs> distributed in. Distributed in? <laughs> about, right. This is a success. It looks pretty go, awesome. I can go far places. Yeah, you can. Look at that. Wow, you made like an actual floating raft with giant Legos and everything. Woo! You did it. Look at that. All right, I feel like I can go a long way. You already are, look at that. You're floating all the way over the deep end now and you're not even having a problem with it. Mine's not even really like a boat. You're not even wet or anything. I'm just gonna be like floating halfway in the water. I'm really impressed, Ginger. This is really cool. Carla, I can be here all day. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you get your wrap, put it in, let's see if yours floats. It's the moment of truth. All right. So you might as well just jump on in. All right, so she just wants me to get on my chair and get in the water with her. I've got a strategy with my big sun hat. Stay out of the sun. I think I'm gonna be able to float just fine as well. So challenge accepted. All right, Carl, <laughs> let's see how this goes for you. I'm really excited. I'm really not even that worried. Should I just see? Let's see if it floats first of all. Okay, Ooh. it floats, it the, floats, people. The goal? Is the wow, lounge chair fence. Actually oh, it's see? so hot from being in the sun. Alright, should we just try and get on and see? Yeah. All right. This is gonna be my favorite part. I can just I just know it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, oh, oh, oh! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Carl! I was overconfident, okay? <laughs> I have too much floaty on the front. It just backflipped me right that over the back. That was so, <laughs> that really did just flip you right backwards. I gotta try it again. Attempt number two. It's hard, it's like, you gotta really <laughs> it just right, get on there just right. Balance, balance, balance. Carl, it's all in your mind. You're right. You're <laughs> totally right. Oh, hey, that works. That's wonder, working. Can I lounge it's back kind of at working. all? Is it like, comfortable? Mine's not very comfortable. Wait, wait, wait a second. Wait a, wait second. a second. Oh my goodness! You're kind of floating. Yeah! <laughs> I don't okay. know if I win. I think I kind of lost this one because way too much foam <laughs> floating underneath my knees. It's technically working though. It kind of is, but I feel like if I just go like this, I'm going to go, wee! <laughs> oh, he's splashing my boat. And then it becomes like a big. Crazy air pocket trap. Wow, it's come like with me. It's like breathing underwater. Yeah, check this out. It's like a little secret fort inside here, guys. See? <laughs> hey, what's up? It's my secret chair for it. I'm still in mine, by the way. I haven't, I haven't sunk yet. Really? So, Is that true? Really the last to sink. Ah, you're the last to sink. Ah, ah. Goodbye. <laughs> you guys, I think it's obvious who won this challenge. Ginger, you get the $10,000 check. You're the last 
to sink for sure today. I thought for sure that your giant Lego Tupperware boat was gonna <laughs> sink for sure. But uh, mine was not balanced, as cool as it looked and as awesome as I thought the idea was, it just did not work. But if you like this video, you're gonna love everything that you see on screen. Also check down in the description box for other of our friends' videos and more. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye. That was so fun. That was so fun. That gives me an idea.